Welcome pen friends, this is Tom with Gold Spot Pens here with another live unboxing of a fountain pen of which is a new and exclusive, so this is a Gold Spot exclusive fountain pen from our friends at Monte Grappa from Bassano del Grappa in Italy. We have the Monte Grappa. This is a Monte Grappa box, of course. It's a paper stock sort of type of box, like a paper board. It has a little magnetic flap. We open it up. We have a gold, we have a silver foil, Monte Grappa logo here, and we have the pen, which is in a Monte Grappa baggie, uh, like a Ziploc baggie here. And we'll get to that in just a second. We'll just show what's what else is in the box here. We also have two ink cartridges, international style ink cartridges that have Monte Grappa uh, foil stamped on the side there. And we pull up on this felt platform to get to the warranty booklet with all sorts of user instructions, guarantee, a little bit of information about the company, has a warranty card in there too. Well, let's talk about the pen. Let's put this all aside for right now. This is, like I said, a brand new pen. Not a new pen design because this has been a pen that Monte Grappa has introduced about a year or so ago. This is the Monte Grappa Elmo. Uh, not Elmo is in Sesame Street Elmo. Elmo is in one of the founding... Uh, uh, name, the founding brand name for Monte Grappa back in 1912 was uh, Monte Gra Elmo Monte Grappa, and uh, it's one of the oldest names in fine writing in Italy. So uh, they decided to create this edition in respect to that heritage. The Elmo itself is a streamlined pen, so the cap in the barrel, as you see, has no break in the design there. The band that's here is actually a barrel band, so this band decoration that's here is a uh, chrome, polished chrome clip here, a little bit of an arc to it, has a wheel as in most traditional Italian made pens, has a little wheel clip that makes it a bit easier to slide in and out, has got a quite a tight tension, it's an L bracket type clip, it's tension fixed on there, as um, Monte Grappa is engraved and filled in white, and as you can see here this Monte Grappa, like I said, is a exclusive edition. What makes it exclusive is the material. The material is called Graffiti Turquoise. It's quite a lovely chatoyant and translucent turquoise. Also, I'll show you the translucency as I'm turning the nib. You can see it moving in the cap, which is pretty cool. You can also see the barrel threads moving and you can see the cap threads quite clearly through the acrylic. And as I'm turning it here, you can see the cat's eye chatoyance of this material as well. So it's got a couple of awesome characteristics that you do like to see about an acrylic pen, which is the razzle dazzle of a chatoyant type pen that hits the light and reflects it in, so, in, in a way that almost mimics celluloid with that deep luster and that reflection, um, but uh, but is also a lot less flammable than celluloid. And it also has that translucency that a lot of people enjoy about demonstrators, but uh, not quite a demonstrator, of course, because you can't see through certain parts of it. So opening up the cap and taking a look at the section, we have a pretty good sized section with rather blocky section threads. And we take off the grip here to reveal the Monte Grappa converter that's inside here, which is a screw in type threaded converter, international size. And we can see as we put the converter back in, let's see if you could take a look at the converter that's inside there, but you can't really, I suppose. But, um, I would not recommend doing any sort of eyedroppering of this pen because you have this metal sleeve that's here that the converter attaches to. But that is the Elmo in a nutshell. 
This is a, like I've mentioned before, an exclusive edition with gold spot pens. This is something that we selected the acrylic material for and said, hey, Montegrappa, this material looks molto bene. Make us some pens. Make us these Elmos. And we have about 300 pieces. And it's a special edition for 2019. So once the allotment of inventory that we sell out is gone, this is going to be gone for good. It is not limited but it's not numbered either, but it is kind of a special edition. So, you know, this is one of those things where it's not really like, oh, this is going to be really, really scarce. But at the same time, if you do miss out on it, it will be gone for good. So um, talking about the pen and the streamlined shape, we talked about that, we talked about the clip. Uh, also, oh, OK, so didn't talk about the nib yet. So the nib is the Yovo number no. six size nib. Penboy Roy is actually getting one of these pens probably today. And uh, he'll do a review of it in his usual fashion. I'm going to do my review of it, which is going to not be as funny or as entertaining as his, but um, it'll be a review nonetheless. Um, so this is the number six size Yovo nib. It is interchangeable by screwing out the nib and feed housing. So you, if you do have another number six Yovo nib in a different brand, you could use it with this pen and the interchange it, you know. And also has the writing style that you would expect of a Yovo uh, type of nib, which we'll get to in just a minute. So let's move this aside here. Roy knows that my unboxings and reviews are not as funny as his stuff. Come on. I'm only spending 15 minutes doing this, so I can't be as uh, as talented, as humorous as in my uh, impromptu musings. All right, so... Let me take a look with the writing sample. Oh, and um, measurements but it, they'll be in the description notes below. So definitely check those out in the description notes below, or they're also on the website too when you take a look at the pen on goldspot.com. So the pen does post, as you see here, and it posts pretty snugly, or snug, and it's not going to come off. You try to shake it off, it's not gonna come off there. So it does fit pretty nice. I just had to struggle to kind of get it off the back end there. Oh, there's definitely no risk at all with these Monte Grappa um, Elmo nibs because they come with the Yovo, the German uh, made Yovo number six size nib. I mean, as far as consistency is concerned, much better quality than the uh, Monte Grappa stainless steel nibs that were on there initially, which I believe were made by Bach. Um, but, uh, but definitely a lot more of a consistent performance and smoothness and, and ink flow to the Yovo nibs, definitely a, a big improvement that was needed in this line, for sure. And this is called Graffiti. Turquoise. And this is inked with Monte Grappa Turquoise, also available at Gold Spot in 50 ml bottles. And this is a medium point. Stainless steel. Nib. If you're clicking in the background, that is my man Josh doing lots of photo editing. And now he's going to be conscientious of all of the clicking that he's doing. <laughs> Thank you. But I just kind of wanted to explain that being that somebody might hear it and be thinking like, oh, the nib is clicking as you're writing, and that's not the case, you know? <laughs> I 
Yeah, so as you would expect, as I would expect, being that I've owned several pens that have a Yovo number six size nib, the nib performs right out of the box, nice flow, good smoothness, has a little bit of tooth to the writing, but I mean, also I'm used to writing with gold nibs and all sorts of different types of, of type, you know, types of other nibs. But when you say like, okay, well, is it scratchy? Definitely not. So like on the range of like one being scratchy and 10 being glassy, smooth, I would put this one at towards the end here, towards the 10 side. I would say maybe like an eight, you know, has just a slight bit of feedback, but not enough that you would even consider to say that this would be at all scratchy. But it's a good match as far as the turquoise ink is concerned to match with this pen. So um, if you are looking for an ink to go with the Monte Grappa Elmo Graffiti Turquoise, Monte Grappa Turquoise is a pretty good connection right there. All right. And the pen is very comfortable with the cap posted. It's made of acrylic, so the weight is fairly nice, and it's not too lightweight where it's, it feels like it's a cheap pen. It uh, definitely feels like a solid acrylic pen. Very little metal decoration on here, so the weight is on the lighter side. But like I said, still has a good feel in hand and you know has a great kind of like, I would say a you know, just a very simplified, dignified look uh, as far as the aesthetics are concerned. So it's not overly decorated like you would expect with a lot of Monte Grappa pens being very artsy and ornate. Um, but some of these lines that Monte Grappa came up with, like the Fortuna or the Elmo or the Monte Grappa, Monte Grappa, um, kind of take a more simplified approach, which is nice because it just allows the material to be the showstopper and it doesn't get in the way with putting too many uh, different like embellishments on there. So uh, a very nice, like very traditional style pen. And you know, it's got a great size with the cap posted on the back, uh, you know, good weight for it posted as well. If you like it posted, if you like it unposted, the pen's back end here still comes between the webbing of my thumb and uh, forefinger there so it does uh, write pretty nicely either way And so for the the bad, as Mr. Roy would say, or the, yes, the good, the bad, the ugly, so it would be the, this would be the bad part. Let's talk coin. So this pen, the retail price is 225 US dollars. Our sale price is going to be $180. And that, my friends, will also include free priority or FedEx two-day, which we've been doing a lot more of since we've kind of switched a lot of our shipping over to FedEx two-day for anybody that is in the United States.
So that is part of our free shipping promotion of orders of 75 or more. Since this is a value pen at uh, $180, usually pens of that we upgrade to a priority or a second day uh, via FedEx, like I show here. So um, definitely check it out if you're interested at goldspot.com. You could find these specs. Uh, either below in the description once I put them up on there or on goldspot.com uh, and also you could check out this pen and grab it with a nice bottle of uh, Monte Grappa turquoises while you're at it as well. So I appreciate you guys tuning in and as always, thank you my friends. Take care.